At first glance, the crowded and busy center for the rescue effort looks like it has for more than a week. The good news that the boys were found by two British divers on Monday night means only half of the job here is done. We are coming. It's okay. It's okay. Many people are coming. Many, many people. We are the first. Many people come. What's Monday? Monday. Monday. Okay, but one week and Monday. You have been here <laughs> 10 days. 10 days. You are very strong. That second half of the job will be very difficult, getting them all out safely. But family members are already thinking of what they'll do once they are out. When Apiradi Wong Suk Chung heard the good news, all she wanted to do was hug her nephew. I hope all of them come out safely, not only my nephew, everyone who is stuck in the cave. Divers and doctors are now going back and forth to the boys and their football coach who found refuge on a ledge when the cave flooded following torrential rain. The divers are checking on their health and taking them food and water. They're said to be in good health with only slight injuries, but they're emaciated. The group is 400 meters further into the cave system than the so-called Patia Beach section, where rescuers originally thought they might be. Getting them out isn't expected to be easy. Reaching them requires a technically difficult and dangerous dive through narrow passages and low visibility. And the trapped teenagers will have to be quickly trained to use scuba equipment so they can swim out. A day after the boys and their coach were found, all eyes are focused here, and that's for two reasons. This is where the dive teams are headquartered, but also this is most likely where the 13 will exit the cave and be loaded into ambulances. When they will see daylight for the first time is difficult to predict. Rescue teams are pumping water out of the cave and continue their search for another escape route. Because of the difficult conditions for rescuers both in and outside the cave, like the search operation, the rescue is expected to be slow going.